a pleasant morning. Such a day is truce to vice, as an infant borning proves a man may be born twice. While such a sun does burn, vile sinners may return. So if your neighbor is a drunkard or a thief, just you let him labor in the sunshine like a leaf. What though his rind is rotten, his faults are all forgotten. The gentle rains expand with joy his debauched veins. I love to see that nature is so rife with life. Myriads can be afforded to be sacrificed. Those tadpoles gobbled up by herons as they sup. A poet sees a universal innocence in how tenderly are squashed out of their existence. Those tortoises and toads run over in the road. March brings the floods because it's raining flesh and blood. Singular rattling sound as a slight and graceful soaring hawk did tumble down. It sported in the air like a kite was falling there. An ethereal flight, I never witnessed such a sight. The sky so pure and bright, all things must live in such a light. On the first day of spring, O oh death, where is thy sting? O oh grave, where is the victory you do crave? By early May, the landscape brightens with the trees. Even cloudy days, the maples, oaks, and hickories show that the sun insists on breaking through the mists. And very soon, methinks I hear a whip or will on the pond alone, and she winks at my window sill. The Phoebe comes once more. And looks in at my door. The seasons pass.